Hey Biscuits, welcome back to the channel. So I haven't done any really sort of yoga vlogs in a little while now. Um, I did one little Christmas breathing one, but I thought it would be fun to do a stretch out your chest, open up your breath, and anxiety one. And I've talked about on here um, in my daily vlogs that I have developed this panic disorder from being ill. Um, from my chest pains I've gotten, you know, my cartilage has gotten, had gotten inflamed from having the flu and it just kind of spiraled down into being really sick, I was hospitalized and then after all of that I was so traumatized by it that I've been getting panic attacks and I still am, um, you know, with less frequently. I'm not getting them multiple times a day now, at least I can function. But one of the things that has helped me has been learning to stretch out and breathe and take time for self-care. That has been so valuable and it's been a big wake up call of, oh, you know, if I'm having these panic attacks, that it's okay. It's okay to be kind to myself. Um, if you're here and you found this vlog because you're having panic attacks, I'm so sorry that you're going through that. I know how scary and bewildering suddenly developing panic attacks can be. But there are ways to, you know, get through the panic attack. It's, I don't know of any ways to stop it in its tracks. But to get through it, to survive it, it's not going to kill us. A panic attack is just our body responding in a really base way to thinking that it's in danger, even if we aren't really, right? So one of the things we can do to help those early stages of that tingling and that feeling of maybe crawling up the wall a little bit, like you're going to get a panic attack. And for me, it's helped my not then accelerate into like a full-blown, on-the-ground, vomiting, shaking, um, panic attack, which is no fun. So this is one of the things, you know what, I'm going to pop off these little booties. I got these. Oh, yeah, and I don't want to take them off. They're so warm, but they aren't the best for yoga. I will admit, they're just super cozy. So, oh yeah, I got a new for Christmas. <gasps> I'm stopping yoga man. I'm pretty excited about that. So we're going to start out just on the yoga mat, and then I'm going to bring in a foam roller. Um, you can do this all just on the ground, on your carpet. Yeah, you can do it on your bed, uh, whatever works for you and your joints. You can always, always talk to your doctor, especially if you're having panic attacks, just to clear whatever you're doing with them, right? But these are things that have helped me a lot. So I'm gonna lay back. Oh, I'm gonna stretch out my arms like this. Oh, feet planted firmly. And the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna focus on every single toe being firmly planted on the ground. So I'm focusing on my baby toes, all of my toes as they get bigger and bigger and get to my big toes. <sighs> I'm breathing in. And then I'm focusing on my whole feet feeling the yoga mat. chest. Arch my back just the tiniest bit here. I'll open up my chest. Big deep breath. Ready? We're going to belly breathe. So we're breathing in through our tummies. Then I'm going to breathe out. Close my nostrils. Breathe out of my mouth. Again, put your feet on the ground. Arms on the ground. Chest open. We're just centering ourselves, that's all we're doing, right? Oh. And then we're going to stretch our legs a little bit. Just touch your arms up here, really simple, easy. Pull on through and focus on your toes again. Focus on your feet and your hands touching, and you're really going through the sensation of, oh, here are my feet, here are my hands. You aren't worrying about things, you aren't worrying about if you're having a panic attack or if you're spiraling or your health or anything else that might be stressing you out. You are just focusing in the moment on the texture of your feet and your hands. Oh. And then you're going to draw your feet together. You're going to bring your feet down and outward in towards your hips. And then as your hands are holding on, I want you to open up your chest 
and do a big breath with me. Another big one. And then allow your feet to go back. Oh, I want you to push up. stomach muscles. Keeping that tummy engaged. Your shoulders are here and you're, you don't want your shoulders up right here. It's like, how oh, are you? You want them down here, just natural with your chest. Stretch open like this. And keep your arms at whatever distance helps you stretch open your chest muscles. We're going to take another couple big breaths, ready? So we're breathing out of our tummies, ready? We're going to fill our bellies with air. Breathe out. Let's do that again, ready? Breathe in with our tummies. Breathe out. We're going to breathe in one more time, and then as we breathe out, we're going to slowly lower our spine to the mat and really feel each vertebra coming down, ready?
send me photos of you in the merch and it lets me, you know, when I'm feeling panicky at night, sometimes I scroll through Instagram and message back and forth with you lovely biscuits that message me about one of my books or something from a video that really touched you. Um, and it certainly helps me feel a little more connected and distracts me for a moment from some of my anxiety. So take a deep breath. Everything's gonna be okay. Thank you.